Okay, we have uh, two locks that I got from Jeff Moss. Uh, I thought I would do something a little bit more simple today. Uh, this is a uh, four pin Abus Euro. Uh, this is the bidding. The lock is locked. And also have a commando four pin. We will uh, pick it up next. Okay, let's um, open this Abus. We're going to use top of the keyway and uh, this pick. Okay, we've got a little bit of false set out of number three. Number four, give us a little bit more false set. Okay, number one, giving us some feedback. I believe this uh, lock does have some spools in it. Okay, there it is open. Okay, it's uh, about as easy to open as a four pin master lock. So the Abus lock is open. Let's lock it back. We're not going to gut it because it doesn't belong to me. Alright, the commando lock, it does work. It is key retaining. Okay, the lock is locked. This is the bidding on the key. Sorry about that, didn't have it in the camera. The lock does work. Okay, and it is key retaining when the lock is open. You have to have the lock closed before you can uh, pull the key out. Okay, we're locked. All right, let's uh, put it in the vise and open it this morning or this afternoon. Whichever way you want to look at it. Okay, let's use the uh, top of the keyway again. And uh, use this pick. Let's go to the back. Okay, got a little false set out of number uh, three, I believe. Got a little bit more out of number one. A little bit more out of number one. Okay, there it is open. Okay, that... Uh, it's a commando lock open. It opens uh, fairly easy also. Um, all right, now it's locked back. Okay, that's uh, the um, four pin Abus and the four pin uh, commando lock open. Uh, I guess they should have put their name master lock on them. Anyway, um, I thank you for your time. I appreciate it. Please do not do anything illegal, and please stay out of trouble. Thank you. It just uh, seemed like it's hard to open these little four-pin locks when you're um, used to opening these six and seven-pin. Thank you again.